Hey man, I ain't gonna hold y'all. These, these right here, these go crazy. These are fire. <laughs> I bet you don't believe me, right? Watch this. Yes, sir. You too. What's happening with it, man? It's your boy Travi J. Back at you with another video today, man. We're gonna be talking about a shoe that, hey man, it's it's fire, man. It's fire to me, in my opinion. And a lot of people are probably gonna sleep on this one. We didn't see this one coming. Um, I didn't see it coming for that matter. I didn't think I was gonna like these as much as I did, but I took a sneak peek at these, man, and hey man, I'm glad I picked these up, man. So your boy. Your boy went ahead and put an entry in on the sneakers app back last Thursday, and I got them. That's right, man. Your boy went ahead and picked up the women's Air Jordan 12 in that brilliant orange colorway. And yes, I did say women's, man. This was a women's release right here, and in my opinion, man, this one should have been a men's release, man, because, hey, man, when I went back and checked later on after I picked up my pair, all the big sizes were gone. So that tells me that a lot of guys went after these, man. A lot of women probably weren't checking for these like that, but a lot of guys went after these. And it's a neutral colorway in my opinion, man. So it could go either or. It's a unisex colorway. So we're going to check them out, man. And I'm going to show y'all why I think these are so dope in hand. And uh, let me know if y'all went after these as well, man. This was a must cop for me ever since I saw first images of them. I just knew I could definitely knock these out the park, man, with a fresh fit. So anyway, man, we're going to talk about these. I'm going to get my thoughts and opinions on them. I want to know what y'all think as well. And uh, we're going to take it from there. So check it out, man. If this is your first time stopping through, rocking out with your boy, man, go ahead and tap that subscribe button. Smash that like button. Hit that notification bell so that way you're notified every single time I drop another video. And also, if you want to see some dope fits and fly kicks, look your boy up and give me a follow over at Travi J Official, man. That's where it all goes down at, man. Like I said, a lot of times I just want to jump fresh, you know what I'm saying, and throw a little nice fit on, man. So if you want to see all of that, man, that's the place you want to be. And uh, by the way, man, I do want to remind everybody, man, that this is a new channel so any returning subscribers that i have from my old channel this is a new make sure you drop down and hit that subscribe button man let's get these numbers back up where they need to be also drop a like button as well so your boy can get back up in the algorithm man so we can see new faces new places and uh we can take this thing to higher heights you know what i mean but anyway man that's enough of me rambling let's go ahead and jump into these shoes and let's see what they're hitting for all right let's get it Okay, so bam, right here, man. We've never seen anything like this before on a Jordan 12, man. So as you can see, we have a black box with stars all over it, man. We've got an orange jump man in the middle. And I think that's a dope touch for a box, man. Something different. Jordan brand has been killing it lately with the boxes, man. Um, just the presentation is immaculate, in my opinion. So I do give them that. Um, opening up the inside, it's uh, all white. And you do have some clear wax paper with stars on it as well. I'm not sure if the stars are going to show up in the camera. I'm going to try to hold it as close as possible. But, you know, you got white stars all over the wax paper, man. And uh, like I said, it's clear. And I think that was a dope touch as well. Um, I don't see any quality control stickers or lot numbers or anything of that matter inside the box. So we're going to keep it moving right along. Today, we have the women's Air Jordan 12 Retro colorway is going to be black brilliant orange and white went with a size 10 and a half in women's which translates into a men's nine definitely recommend going through the size in your air jordan 12s and with that being said let's get into the meat and potatoes the feature presentation let's give y'all what y'all came to see let me do the honors man and yes sir man we've got the air jordan 12 in that brilliant orange man let's go and get these guys out of the box man let's go and get these guys out of the box and let me give y'all that up close and personal look at these guys bam yes sir talk to me y'all what we doing man what are we doing with the air jordan 12 brilliant orange man come on man if you like the color orange this is a must cop in my opinion Very, very similar to the flu game colorway, man. You know what I'm saying? Pretty much the same makeup. You got the black leather, tumble leather up here on the uppers. 
and you've got just your head of orange all on your mud guard right here at the bottom man very very dope shoe in my opinion one thing that i like about the shoe is that it's got that it's got the right name brilliant orange man it's got that bright fluorescent orange that i like man and uh these are gonna pop when you throw these on feet and step out these are gonna pop man these are definitely gonna turn heads in my opinion so let's go and get into the details of them real quick man so as i mentioned you do got an all black shiny leather tumble leather on your uppers right here pretty much the same as your flu games like i said you know um it's pretty much the same makeup just different colors um you've got your orange pebble look on your mug guard right here on the side it's got that reptilian look as well that you get on your uh jordan 12s you've got a nice orange rubber outsole as you can see there moving around to the back of the shoe you've got your two three and black down here at the bottom you've got your jordan quality inspired by the greatest player ever on the back tab then you got a hit of orange right there in that square with your black jump man on the back of the shoe medial side you got the same thing man leather on your uppers orange on your mud guard orange on your midsole rubber midsole nice dope touch man look at that orange and hot pops y'all like come on man and i don't want to seem like i'm hyping up this shoe too much man but i just I like bright colors, man. I think they stand out. I think they pop. And uh, I, I'm just really digging these, man. I think it's a dope shoe. But uh, coming around to your tongue, you've got, of course, your standard 2-3 that you get on all your Jordan 12s. You got TWO in that 3 in orange as well. Orange jump man at the top right here on your tongue. Nice, nicely placed. And then something different on the bottom. You got your standard Jordan 12 bottom but you've got like a whirl, you got a little twirling action going on right here at the forefront. So look like you're going into the twilight zone or something like that. So I think that was a, a different touch. I'm not crazy about it, but um, I think they should have just left it as is. They should have left it all black, you know, as far as your traction goes, but they got to do something always to do something different. But to, to, I guess to kind of differentiate, you know, women's and men's shoes. But of course you got your black jump man at the top right here at the uh, toe cap. And then on the bottom as well, you got that little circle effect as well. I forget what it's called. I, I'm about to say whirlwind, but it's not a whirlwind. It's just got like that that zone, man, like you in a zone. You know what I'm saying? But of course, you got your carbon fiber hits right here in the middle as well, man. And uh, on the inside, let's see what we got. I know we've got paper on the inside and we've got something different on the outsole. I mean, on the insole. So let's pull them out real quick. So on the right shoe you've got a all white insole with stars all over it as well and uh yeah man i think that's dope man dope touch right there for the ladies and uh i want to say that the other shoe has something different on the inside let's go and pull that out while i got them real quick while i got them out man let's check out the left shoe so yes so pretty much the right shoe has a white insole and the left shoe's got a black one so on your left shoe you do have a black insole with stars all over it as well. Now, I want to say that the theme of this shoe was basically catering to the WNBA. That's the backstory that I read on it. And um, let me fact check that real quick. All right, y'all. So on the sneakers app, it says, what goes together better than high tops and hoops? Maybe the brilliant orange and black on this AJ-12. It's made of full grain leather, textured in parts to look and feel like a basketball. So you're set up to show your love for the game. So... I can't remember where I read that from to where it's paying homage to the WNBA, but according to the Snickers app, it's paying homage to a basketball. I don't know. Um, I, I still could be right as far as the other story goes, but um, it does look and feel like a basketball as far as the little goose bumps and stuff that you see on the mud guard. You know what I'm saying? That textured look. So, um, But yes, man, y'all comment below and let me know if this was a go for you. Um, if you went after these guys, females, Anybody watching this video, man, y'all talk to me and let me know if this was a cop for you. Like I said, it was a must cop for me, in my opinion. Um, you know, maybe a sleeper to some. Um, I do think these will probably uh, not go for much on the resale tip. You know, it's just another Jordan 12. Um, it was no hype around it. It's, it kind of dropped out of thin air, came out of nowhere. So didn't really hear too much, you know, hype or buzz around these at all whatsoever. So just another Jordan 12. I don't think anybody was uh, really checking for them. Right now, everybody's just pretty much got their eyes focused on those UNC toes that's dropping this weekend, man. I think that's gonna be the highlight of the month. 
um they got plenty of pairs i think that's the back to school shoe everybody wants that shoe so pretty much after those unc toes sell out shoes like this the chambray sevens or anything else that comes out in the near future for that matter those are going to be the shoes that gets picked up as a consolation prize if anything you know what i'm saying so um but it's, it's plenty of shoes to go around they're releasing a lot of shoes this month so jordan brand y'all smart I, I i know what y'all doing man y'all y'all marketing is undefeated man i know what y'all doing y'all dropping all these shoes around the same time because it's back to school and they're gonna sell out i mean we got black toe lows releasing soon um unc to chicago blows dropping soon as well so and all them shoes are going to sell out because it's back to school. So it is what it is. But anyway, I don't want to get off subject, man. Y'all talk to me. Let me know how y'all feel in the bottom. Scale of 1 to 10, how y'all rating these. Man, I give these a solid 9 out of 10 um, because I just like 12s. I, do, I really do like 12s. I like this colorway. I think it pops. I think it's a bright orange. And, uh, hey, man, this would be a nice little look for Halloween. You know what I'm saying? And uh, we're going to kill it with these, man. Y'all stay tuned to the Instagram page, man. I mean, I'm going to drop something fire with these. So y'all stay tuned and be on the lookout for that. But other than that, man, I think I'm going to go and wrap this one up. Um, I pretty much, you know, gave y'all my thoughts and opinions on them. Y'all comment below and let me know what y'all think about them as well. And with all that being said, man, I'm going to go and get out of here. So I appreciate y'all for tuning in and checking out this video. Like, comment, subscribe. Tell a friend to tell a friend to check out my videos as well. Yes, we are still on the race to 1,000 subscribers, man. So, like I said, if you are a returning subscriber or if you are new to the channel, please make sure you can scroll down below, hit that subscribe button, hit that like button as well so your boy can move up in the algorithm and reach new eyes, man. So, you know, that way I have the opportunity to get more subscribers as well so we can go and get this thing back to where we left off at. You know what I'm saying? But anyway, man, I'm out of here, man. I'll catch y'all on the next one. But before I go, I just want to let you know you never get a second chance to make a first impression. So always put your best foot forward. And on that note, y'all stay blessed. Y'all stay fresh. And I'm going to holler at y'all on the next one. All right? In a minute.